Hey folks, it's JP. It's Friday. It's uh, May 25th, and I'm in Harahan, Louisiana. We're in Harahan? River Ridge. I'm in River Ridge, Louisiana. Okay. And um, you know, there's there's been a uh, some pictures of a uh, hive that was in a barbecue pit that was eradicated, and uh, it's been going around for quite a few years. Well, guess what? I got called out, and there's bees underneath the cover of a barbecue pit. I'm going to show you what this looks like and we're going to go ahead and remove them. So I hope you all enjoy the video. We're going to remove them and give them a new home. So here's our barbecue pit. So we've got this big cover over it. All right, we're going to come in. The bees are entering down here. Okay, Let's see if you can catch a few of them. There's, there's one right there. Okay, there's one right there. There's another one. Okay. They have this little, I guess it's like a little vent flap or something. And when you when you pull this back, okay, there's a little little bits of comb that are falling down by that velcro. And you can I don't know if you can see this or not, but there's bees on the on the screen right there. Let me show you what it looks like underneath. Okay. I'm laying down I'm underneath the cover, and there's a hive. So they're attached. It looks like to the uh, that the underside of this burner. Okay. Very cool setup. Buddy Emil showed up and uh, helped me uh, remove this uh, barbecue pit cover. And you can see the bees are really digging that cover. <laughs> I guess it's been home for the last week or two and. So uh have got a medium uh, set up right here. And here's our comb. Look how they attach themselves to the bottom of this burner here. It's pretty unique. You know, I don't run across this. This is the first time I've run across this. Okay, hands down, first time. But, uh, you know, this, this bulb, the cover, you know, just created a dark void for them. And so, uh, you know, that's pretty much why they showed up. You know, they didn't know the difference between this this void space and a hole in a tree or you know void space in a house so this is what we have and we're gonna go ahead and remove them pretty thing <laughs> alright this is where we are we've removed uh, one two three four comb sections and uh, these are nice and friendly I guess they wasn't but a swarm maybe a week or so ago Bunching up big time down here. We kind of wonder if maybe they're acting like the queen's over there, but I think she's probably still in there. But, uh, framing up a little bit of this, it's really new comb and it's top heavy. That new honey it's kind of falling apart on us, so might not be able to save too much comb. But uh, I'm bringing in tallow and ligustrum. Ligustrum is blooming big time right now. We got all our comb out for the most part. Might be a few little bits and pieces up there, but Got a big clump of bees here, and uh, we think our queen's right up in there somewhere. We would, we would say that. Let's see where we are. Yeah. So this is what we left with. You'd have to think that queen was up in here somewhere, folks. So I'm going to go ahead and probably pick up this end and just bump it a little bit. See if we can't dislodge them and find our queen. Maybe bump it a little bit and see if we can dislodge them. I gotta catch her too. Oh yeah, that'll work. I could be wrong but plus but I thought I saw something that caught my eye and then it disappeared. There she is, right there. Get her, get her, get her, get her, get her. Tiger strike. Hold her up here. Well, she's golden on the bottom and kind of tiger on the top. You got a couple she's, more rub bands? She's definitely pretty clean. Yeah, I got a whole bag right here. You know, she kind of reminds me a little bit of the one you caught yesterday at that movie. Yeah, she's prettier. The one I caught yesterday was. Yeah, you're right. But she is kind of pointy, though, huh? Yeah. She's 
pointy like that over there. Yeah. Look at her, folks. She's pointy. She's a nice queen, though. And she makes some gentle babies. That's for sure. That's all we care about, folks. Lots of babies and gentle ones with that. All right. All right. Barbecue pit bees. Honey tastes like pork chops. <laughs> Grilled chicken. Yes, indeed. All right. We'll clean it up a little bit. We'll shake that uh, cover and move it away. We put our little top on there. Smoke them or you want to bounce it? Or? Nice little situation going on there. All right, folks, so there you have it. Barbecue pit bees in the River Ridge, Louisiana, removed. With JP? Nemo. You'll have a happy Memorial Day. Be safe. Take care now. Watch out for the crazy. Until next one. Bye. <laughs>